Yes, I'm back again to discuss music trend, and the artist on our radar today is Whiskey. If you don't already know, Whiskey is trending, and this time around, he's not trending for anything positive, to be honest, right? He came on Instagram. And this is like a typical whiskey going on multiple rants. I call it like blowing off steam. And he's been writing a quite lot. At this point, I think the only artist that so far has been incredible and consistent when it comes to, you know, giving accolades to our genre is Davido. Davido doesn't play with this genre and he takes every opportunity he has to promote this genre. And for whiskey, after this rant that you've ranted about Afrobeat, your next album better come correct, really. You know, you're not going to rant like this and then drop a trash album. You're not going to rant like this and drop an album that is below par. So you have to come correct on your end and prove everybody wrong, you know, when it comes to your music. It's a sad one. It's a sad one from a legend, a big name like him to, to do something like this. So let's just quickly go through what he said. The first thing he posted on his Instagram story was album done with the ego emoji and he said see you soon b then he goes on to brag about his son being richer than every other person okay this is just you know degrading and laughing at your fans i don't i don't tolerate that i don't think that is something that someone of your level and status should be doing then he went on again you know more ranting and please i beg if you like bakuruma whiskey don't download this new album. In fact, delete me from your playlist and your life. Guess what? I do not have any issues with this particular one that he wrote because it's almost like, yeah, he's no more in the face of Bakurumo anymore. He's not that whiskey anymore. He's moved on, he's evolved. So I don't have any issues with him, you know, stating this and making claims to it. So if if you're still gonna keep hating and saying, Oh, I miss that whiskey, Bakurumo whiskey, then don't F with his new music technically. That's what's saying. So I don't I don't have any issues with this. Uh moving to the next one. He said, and if you like Afrobeat, please don't download my album. I draw the line here because you're talking about the genre. You're talking to millions of Afrobeat fans who they've put their sweat and blood on the line for this piece. Streaming Leo's music, you know, coming to your shows, rapping Afrobeat, and for you to throw sand on their faces. I don't f I don't f with this statement at all. This statement is a no no for me. Uh, like I said, the Pakuruma one is okay for you to make claims to that, but for when you mention Afrobeat, when you mention Afrobeat, guy, come correct, man. You gotta come correct for the fans. You know, this is like train insulting the entire African when don't they rock with you for the longest time? Then. The next one on his story again goes, I'm not an effing Afrobeat artist. Don't call me that. I mean, I also have a problem with this. Putting the effing word close to Afrobeats. We got to put some respect on Afrobeats, man. You got to put some respect on our culture. This is a cultural thing, man. Like we, like I said again, we put our blood, our sweat on this. You know, buying your music, streaming your music, coming to shows. We put everything on the line for this P, for you to disrespect this genre like this. I do not F with this, this statement. Then he went on to say, I'm not Afro anything. Then he used an offensive word again. I don't know what he's going through, but my own take is please do not disrespect anything Afro because this is real life. For someone who sang Brown Skin Girl to rubbish Afro the way you are rubbishing Afro, especially because at the point you stood for this, bro, I do not F with it, to be honest, you know? again this is mm -mm, mm -mm, this is not it then let's 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 see if there are any more stuff that we have here that he wrote yeah then he went album name mariah uh best i ever made okay he's making claims now that yeah the album is the best he's ever made this is definitely a tribute to his late mom because 
you know it's, it's no news his mom passed away um i think that was last year big respect to mama Wiz. may her soul rest in peace so i'm guessing this album is dedicated to to her right so technically he changed the name of the album from say less you know to the mom's name so yeah i think this is this is all for it and then he said now nah, everyone should f off <laughs> then he has a word for nigerian blogs he said one more all niger blogs or media don't post my shit when it drops oh na papa we is within the app on within the app on man like seriously if this is promotion antics is a no-no for me honestly there are better ways to do it this is not ad. i'm sorry this is not ad. i did not subscribe to this that's all i have to say what do you guys think put it in the comment section if you enjoyed this video you know the drill don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this and don't forget to share. <laughs>